So at the bottom of Ripon Road, just before Parliament Street, I'm sure you can recognise where we are. Popular place, opposite the Royal Hall. We are at Lucia's Wine Bar and Grill, probably Harrogate's best known Italian restaurant. So right in the heart of the action, in the middle of Harrogate, right in the middle of where all the best bars and restaurants are of the town, is Lucia's. Elizabeth and I do come here reasonably frequently. At the bottom there, that's where the wine bar is, and then you have to walk upstairs to the, the restaurant area. There's lots of outdoor areas, as you can probably see. Right in the middle of winter, they often have fleecy blankets, although we didn't see any, any out there today. That was possibly something to do with COVID. But in you walk, bar on the right-hand side, it was, I think, a Monday or Tuesday night, so it wasn't busy. And they showed us our table pretty quickly and uh, had a little look at the menu. Now, you probably noticed Elizabeth and I are uh, tried and tested. We stick to the same sort of thing. So we had a flatbread to start. We'll show you that in just a minute. 5.75, I think. And uh, we'll show you the rest of the menu in just a minute. There's some of the outdoor areas, as you can see, looking across the Royal Hall, Ripon Road, cars going up. Can't see very much, to be honest. Uh, I've got the menu from the uh, from the website uh, steaks about 24 pounds but then you have to add on all of the sort of extras the chips whatever you have with it so it ends up a bit more expensive i don't like places where you have to add on the side dishes i think it's a little bit uh, disingenuous but lots of uh, pasta area uh, pasta dishes risottos that sort of thing um all around sort of the something something like 12 to 14 pounds burgers around so again, 12 to 14 pounds, something like that. I think the chips were included there and stone baked pizzas there. Similar-ish prices, starting about 11 and going up to about 14 or 15. So what have you ordered? Uh, a garlic and tomato flatbread uh, and a lasagna. Yeah. Nuclear hot. So let's see if it is nuclear hot. I've ordered a pizza. Mm. Yeah. Oh, it's just five pounds, wasn't it? 5.75. 5 5.75. And the soft drinks are about four pounds each, I think. What? Between three and four pounds. Which is why we've got a jug of water. We are both very hungry. The flatbread went down really well, as you can see, quite crispy on the base there, really nice, uh, crunchy. So, what do you think of the flatbread, Elizabeth? Very nice. So, there's my salami pizza. Is it? Your lasagna, so they gave me a pizza wheel with my pizza. I always prefer just a steak knife or something. Now, it was very tasty, salami pizza as you can see, but I found it, the crust, a little bit soggy, if I'm honest. Um, not as crispy a base as I would have liked. I did put some garlic oil on it, so that might have been a little bit to do with that, but the actual side of it, there was no oil on that and it wasn't as crispy as it looks. That said, as you can see, not much left at all. Did enjoy it. No. So the best part of £37. Uh, no drinks there, so that's just two mains plus the, the flatbread starter. Do be uh, aware that there is a 10% automatic service charge that's put on there. The, uh, the server, who was very good, by the way, did explain that to us, though, so there was no risk of... Uh, of missing that so just be aware that the tip is already added on they do have uh, branches in beverly york and harrogate hey and uh, out we go did enjoy it uh so 37 pounds for just two mains and a flatbread so it's not not cheap not expensive i would say middle of the road very pleasant i think i just had a, a refurb i'm gonna go back out now uh there's some of the outdoor areas we can see not being used it was quite a cold night but uh, I imagine that's very, very busy if there's a conference on or if there is, uh, or if it's just a nice summer night, nice outdoor area, smoking area, I guess, just outside there. And uh, there's the a view of the wine bar again. So I'm giving Lucia's four dragons, a score of uh, 3.5. Uh, certainly would, uh, would return. So really well located in the centre of Harrogate. Parking can be a problem sometimes, but not tonight. Uh, there's a lot of parking down by the old council house. Anyway, I hope this has been of some use to you. Do give me a like if it has, and hope to see you again.
Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then please consider subscribing to this channel. Also, I'd be very grateful if you could like this video and hit that notification bell. If you do that, you'll continue to receive lots more rubbish just like this.